The worship of Jesus Christ is the worship of Zeus. Zeus was the god of the Europeans 600 years before Christianity. So when you go back 600 years before Christianity, you'll find out that the way Zeus is referred to is the same way Jesus is referred to in the New Testament. 600 years before Christianity, it is written that in Zeus, humanity exists and have their being. And that Zeus is not dead, but Zeus lives forever. L Zeus is the High and Holy One. The same thing you have in your New Testament about Jesus. That in Jesus Christ you were created before the world began. That Jesus is not dead, but He lives forever. That Jesus is what? Holy, High, God. There's no difference. The 600 years before Christianity, Zeus has prophets. Christianity, you have prophets, you have pastors, you have teachers. All these things existed 600 years before Christianity itself. But the New Testament uses the Old Testament scriptures and verses to create a new story for you to worship Zeus. When you look at these writings here, it is very similar to what you have in your New Testament. Look at what they are saying about Zeus. They fashioned a tomb for thee. O oh, Holy and High One. Who is Holy and High One in the New Testament? Jesus Christ. Who was put in a tomb? Jesus Christ. Then he went on to say, The Cretans always liars, evil beasts, idle bellies. So they have an opposition. And the New Testament always defending themselves against somebody that is challenging them. So he went on again and said, But thou art not dead. Thou lives and abides forever. That is, this is what is said about Jesus in the New Testament. He's not dead. He's alive. He lives forever. But these writings here are for Zeus 600 years before Christianity. Then he went on to say that, For indeed we live and move and have our being. Why do you think believers preach Christ? So that you can be in Christ and have life. This thing, ideology existed 600 years before Christianity. To live in Zeus and have life. In you we live, move and have our being. This was said 600 years ago before Christianity about Zeus. The same thing you have in your New Testament. That in Zeus you live, you move and you have your being. So Zeus is, was the god of the Europeans. And in the New Testament, Zeus is still the God. That's why they use the name Jesus instead of Joshua or Yeshua. It's about Zeus. It's not about anyone else. Jesus is not in scripture. The name Jesus, the name Yeshua, Anointed One, Yeshua Christ, Yeshua Messiah, it's not in scripture. This is all formulated for you.